there's no facet of healthcare today that isn't impacted by regenerative medicine. As I've seen all across with colleagues in every discipline of healthcare, that facet remains true. There's now a recognition that regenerative therapies may not only be able to treat the symptoms, the pain, the dysfunction associated with disease, but actually help to prevent and preserve tissue and preserve healing. Breakthroughs in tissue engineering and cell therapies, they're really expanding the potential applications of regenerative medicine. It's now seen as a revolutionary way to tackle chronic diseases, injuries, and age-related conditions. And with an aging population and the prevalence of chronic conditions like heart disease or neurodegenerative disorders, as well as the growing incidence of sports-related injuries, there's an increasing demand for treatments that go beyond symptom management and focus on repairing or replacing or regenerating damaged tissue and organs. Regenity is a global leader in bioresorbable devices that repair tissue, soft tissue and bone. And we do this with more than 14 different technology platforms that are based on collagen, bioceramics, and synthetic polymers. We are a business-to-business -business innovator. We're partnering with over 125 leading medical device companies around the world uh, as we continue to bring innovation to life. And today we're impacting more than 4 million patients a year with our technologies and more than 25 million since the company's inception. Our aim is to deliver life-changing transformations as a global leader in regenerative medicine. Our products are made from three primary sources collagen, bioceramics, and synthetic polymers that we utilize across multiple technology platforms. We then take these technology platforms and apply them over 14 unique processes. We can create devices that demonstrate unique handling properties and clinical performance that can serve a variety of unmet needs. Regenity is already having a profound impact on the world of orthopedics and sports medicine for me today. And I see the work that they're continuing to do to have amazing impact to, for patient care and for physicians in the years to come. You know, regenerative therapy, as I shared, has to always be rooted in the fundamental principles. Uh, we have to remember as part of this process, what is the normal healing response of the body? And it's fundamentally the inflammatory response after injury or surgery that then goes through the repair phase, the remodeling phase, and finally um, the phase to full return to activity and life. And I feel like the products of Regenity are building on those principles. It's delivering a scaffold that can support the normal biology of the body. It's augmenting with the appropriate growth factors and inductive factors that can stimulate the biology of the human body to promote that response. And it's attacking the areas where we currently have limited treatments today. The patient who's lost a meniscus, the patient who's had a recurrent rotator cuff tear with a poor chance for healing, the patient who has had challenges in forming adhesions and scar tissues in the setting of prior surgery. Those are unmet needs today that create glass ceilings for the outcomes of our patients. Regenity's deep expertise in regenerative technologies using collagen, bioceramics, and synthetics puts us at the forefront of innovation. And our team's extensive experience in developing and scaling regenerative devices allows us to anticipate and address the complexities of manufacturing these advanced products. The meniscus in the knee uh, is one of the most important structures that I deal with and treat on a daily basis. Meniscus tears, accordingly, are one of the most challenging conditions for us to treat. We have an improved understanding over the past 30 or 40 years of how critical the meniscus is. But where we still lag behind is our ability to restore that when that meniscus tissue is lost and torn in a way where we have to remove it from the knee. This is an area and opportunity where I feel like regenerative medicine can be transformative, much as it has had uh, transformative impacts in shoulder surgery. Rejuveny is a product that is fundamentally a meniscus scaffold. The idea is that when we have to remove meniscus tissue, today we have no ability to put that back. That is simply lost and the mechanics and kinematics of the knee are fundamentally changed. 
if we have the ability at the time of those surgeries to restore that meniscus tissue, have it incorporate and become part of the patient's native meniscus, that can truly change the natural history of the meniscus deficient knee, which for years has been known to progress to arthritis and ultimately a knee replacement. Uh, why I'm excited about Rejuvene is that it has gone through the steps uh, which are critical for regenerative therapies. First and foremost, um, meeting the mark of safety. Secondly, showing in well-controlled animal studies that it incorporates and becomes part of the, of the native tissue uh, with good blood uh, supply in growth, good incorporation of cells and native tissue into that scaffold. And now, as we uh, launch into clinical trials, hopefully be able to show that alteration in the natural history of what happens um, in the meniscus deficient knee. We aim to make a patient's next surgery last, offering lasting solutions that minimize the need for repeated surgeries. This is what we aim to achieve with the Rejuvene meniscal implant. One of the most exciting new areas for Regenity and this market is the development and application of biocomposites, which is when we develop a material by combining two or more of our primary materials to support tissue repair, regeneration, or healing. These materials are designed to mimic the properties of natural tissues while enhancing mechanical strength, bioactivity, or biocompatibility. Because of our technology platforms and expertise, Regenity is particularly well-versed in the development of these biocomposites and working with several of our partners on products that will come to market in the near future. I feel like the products of Regenity, as they continue to evolve to meet the needs of those patients, are going to change the face of orthopedics in the next 10 to 20 years to come. Our people represent the lifeblood of the organization and an integral part of why we make a material difference for our customers and patients. Our customers are seeking a high pace of innovation. They're looking for partners like us to be on the leading edge of developing bioabsorbable technologies, and we do just that. We have the design assets, the intellectual property, the tech platforms, and we've got 27 years of experience processing these materials. This leads us to being able to generate what we believe are the most differentiated solutions delivered in the most efficient manner.